friends welcome to free cat tutorial and in this tutorial we will convert this 2d sketch into the 3d model as I have already did it and it is a very basic level tutorial for the beginner user who just started learning the free cat so I will show you from the scratch how I did it so first I will clear all this markup on my drawing and we will start from the scratch and we will do it so here I will close it and again I create a new file and here I have activated my part design workbench so in part design workbench either we can go with the part or with body so simply I will go here with a body anytime I can insert the part and I can place my body in inside of this part you can see and anytime I can disassociate my body with the part so this part work as a container now I will go with the body and here I will on my plane so in this tutorial we will parallelly read the drawings and we will do model so here if we see our drawing so first we will find our overall length dimensions so here we can see that it is a 110 60 and 80 so I will select this XY plane and I will say sketch and I will draw a rectangle and I will close it and I will hide my plane again I did my sketch <coughs> so I will give dimension it is a uh, hundred and ten this is uh, sixty and I will close it and here our extrusion height would be the 80 which we can see here I change here my pencil color so here is 80 so I will give pad and give dimension of 80 so we have made it sol solid block first and then I will select this phase and I will say sketch and I will draw a rectangle here and now we will remove the material at this portion so for that we require edges these two edges and now I will constrain it same way I select this point and this one and I will say constrain now we will give dimensions this 25 30 so I will give here 25 and here I will give 30 now I will close it and I will say cut and here I will say through all so this is the basic shape which we have achieved now we will remove material at this portion and its dimension is here 40 and 25 so simply we will select this face and I will say sketch and I will draw a rectangle here from this point to this one it is 35 35 this is 40 and this vertical height 25 I will move dimensions to the outside so I will close it I will say cut and I will say through all now we will make this two hole countersink hole so I will select this face and say sketch so our hole is a 6 mm through and then it is a counters 
countersink hole with dia 12 with 5 mm depth in FreeCAD you cannot draw make a hole with the help of a point you have to draw some <coughs> circle even though size is doesn't matter but we will do it approx uh, as it is in our drawing so it is 6 mm so I will select this circle and I will say diameter constraint of 6 and I will select this two circle and I will make it equal and now I will constrain my whole position so I require these two edges so I will project it now I will give dimension it is a 25 and then it is 30 and then it is 50 50 and I will give a horizontal constraint so if I switch to the isometric you can see our hole is fully constrained and I will say close now I will click on this hole features so here in threading size I will say none and here diameter 6 is true which we can see here so 6 and here dimensions through all and here and here in hole cut type I will select countersink and it is a diameter 12 so I will give here 12 and then its depth is 5 so 6 12 and 5 mm depth so you can see that hole has been made now I will say ok now we will give rest of the features chamfer and fillet so we can see here 3 mm 45 degree chamfer is given on these four edges so I will select this all four edges and I will say chamfer and here I will give 3 mm and I will select here equal distance here are the multiple options equal distance two distance distance and angle so I can give in both the ways either I can give distance and angle or two distance so simply it is a 3 mm so it will automatically come with 45 degree so now I will say ok now here is a radius of a 6 on these two edges so I will select these two edges and I will say fillet and I will say 6 mm and I will say ok so this is how we have modeled this part and we have covered all the dimensions in this tutorial we parallelly read our drawing and according to we have uh, made this model now our model is completed so we will give it some color so I will go here and I can give some random colors or I can go in appearances sections and I can give my own color but uh, here I will choose some random color so FreeCAD will give some random color to my part I did not like this one so I will again click on random color so this looks good so this is how uh, I have made this part and I will provide this 2D sketch and this source 3D model in the video description so any beginner user who is a practicing FreeCAD or just a starter learner in the FreeCAD can refer my 2D drawings and practice themselves and in the case of any doubt they can refer my 3D model which I have used in this, in this tutorial so this is all about this tutorial I will come with more useful tutorial on a free card if you like my method of teaching and if you want to support me then please like subscribe and share my video your small support will help this channel to grow thank you for watching and thank you for your valuable time